should you buy XRP now or should you wait for it to go down so you can get more XRP for your money welcome back guys it's Cryptoracle here and in today's video we're going to talk about if you should buy XRP now or you should wait for the dip so guys I'll do a bit of a technical analysis but mainly I'll talk about mindset in my previous video I talked about buy when there's blood on the street and I've been tweeting about some of the ideas of what how rich investors and and people that actually make money invest so I'll talk about that and at the end of the video guys I'll show you a chart of if you buy now and, and if the in a hypothetical situ situation if the price goes up and um, how much money you could potentially make so guys without further ado let's get into the video so the first thing that I'd like to say is if you haven't watched my previous video go watch this video in that video I talk about that uh, due to the way people's minds work um, usually the public buy at the top when the price keeps going up people think oh it's gonna keep going higher and higher let me buy it and people buy Bitcoin at 20k but won't buy Bitcoin at 5k so the rich investors the, the the Rothschild or the Warren you know the people that actually make money from it they don't buy at 20k guys they buy it at the bottom I'm not saying this is the bottom and it can't go any further and it's gonna go up but the the understand the the main logic that I'm trying to talk about again I've, I've explained it in my previous video but the gist of it is the rich people the clever people buy at the bottom and sell at the top the newbies the people like us who don't really understand finance as much they buy at the top and sell at the bottom they think oh it's going up it's going to keep going up let me buy some more and when it keeps going down they think oh no way it's going to keep going down I'm going to lose my money let me sell so this is kind of a simple uh, main thing of the, the video that I wanted to talk about so guys um, if you are not an investor it might be worth you just buying XRP and dollar cost averaging so that that's a one strategy that you can do and um, in terms of ripple guys uh, sorry XRP where do I see XRP going XRP is crashed massively guys and we all know and um, I've been doing a lot of technical analysis you can follow me I, I, I'll make a technical analysis video every other day or when there's a key breakout or any key market message uh, that comes out so you can watch the detailed technical analysis there but again just to give you a quick update xrp actually changed the trend and it wasn't a pump and dump like few people were saying it moved up and then it moved up again and we're hoping that it can you know when things move up quickly there's all there's always a pullback but i was hoping that it will carry on it will see the momentum and unfortunately it did not see that and currently guys it's at a very very key level um and there's a lot of confluence here as well if you see so I was hoping it would it would hold the 50% fib level from from the swing high from uh, from back in September the big swing that we saw um, unfortunately it couldn't then now it's approaching 618 and 618 level uh, is also the 886 level as well from the recent swing high so there's a lot of confidence there and not only that there's a resistance line as well from previously so if there's so let's mark this area up if XRP can hold this level um, then yes it can maybe see a move up but again we'll have to see if it can do this because this is a key levels of resistance there's a lot of confluence level the the RSI or the, the oscillator that you use is very low so there could be a potential move up from here so this is the key level that I'm looking at if it drops below the 45 cent level guys we might drop to the 50 moving average or the 786 level there's some resistance there but yeah it needs to needs to hold this level otherwise it can drop a lot further so yeah, that is the from a technical analysis point of view this is what we're looking at and again I'm expecting that it will jump a bit higher from here but that's we'll have to see how that plays out and another key thing to remember is guys if you are not a technical analyst you could always dollar cost average and one topic that I talk about uh, on Twitter is um, having a positioning so I I wasn't sure where, which way XRP would go I was thinking that it could jump off there so I actually bought some XRP and I tweeted about it that I bought some and I was hoping that you know if it jumps up I've got an anti FOMO position in because you know sometimes if price goes up so this I bought it here people were saying oh it's going to keep going lower and it didn't and I made some good money and if it keeps going up you can buy some more so yeah that's the key level that I'm looking at in a gist so if it, if it goes below the 618 level and um, you might want to get out if you're a trader guys if you're a trader that that's a uh, technical analysis again this is more of like an overview video 
so let's look at the chart so if you buy at let's say 50 50 cents uh, and you for example spend ten thousand dollars you will own about twenty thousand xrps right and if you invest a bit lower i'm not saying it will go to 25 cents 35 cents it could it could it could go to 25 cents or it could go to a dollar i mean we don't know what, how the market will react all we're doing is using our technical analysis using market sentiment seeing how the media reacts seeing how twitter reacts this is one of the best indicators guys follow people on twitter see what people are talking about follow me i'll give you an update on when to get out i've been talking about uh, being careful with bitcoin because there's no trend um, and people were buying saying Bitcoin's going to go up but I, I tweeted it about 11 hours ago that Bitcoin's got no trend and now Bitcoin is, is down a couple of percents so yeah follow people on Twitter you can find and learn a lot more so okay let's go back to this video then so if you buy at 25 cents if it goes down you'll get twice the amount of XRP and let's say hypothetically again big mark like um, I'm gonna I just want to make a point because I'm not saying it will definitely go to ten dollars it could go to ten dollars it could go to one cent it could go to hundred dollars at once these are this is a very speculative market again do your own research think about what you believe in some people believe XRP will go to ten dollars hundred dollars with swift and and the potential market availability some people think it could go lower so do your own research before you buy it please do not listen to myself or anyone on the internet to buy XRP do your own research and then make your decision but if it goes to ten dollars guys you will get two hundred thousand dollars worth of dollars out if you sell at ten dollars that is a huge amount of money and if you if you buy it slightly lower you get 250 but does it make that much of a difference I mean fifty thousand dollars is a lot of money but if you're making this amount of money I'd be happy with 20k so so a strategy for you is you could if you're a technical analyst and you know how the markets work and I'm not saying I'm an expert but I've been doing it for years and, and I, I do okay for myself I, I do win trades I lose trades and I'm, I learn and, and improve so if you do that you can do that and like try to get it cheaper but if you try to get it cheaper so if you said oh I'm gonna buy it at 20 cents you would have missed this what 60 percent 50 almost doubled more than double I think yeah almost 2x you would have missed this massive jump up so you, we don't know so the strategy that I will again this is not financial advice a strategy that people can take is dollar cost average so buy hundred dollars worth there two hundred dollars worth here three hundred dollars worth here and just dollar cost average guys so that's a strategy that again I'm not recommend I'm not a financial advisor to recommend you I'm just explaining to you my thoughts and sharing with you my experience so yeah that's my video guys so should you buy now or should you buy the dip it's up to you I mean currently guys I think it will go lower again it could see a jump up there but I if I if you if I if you put a gun to my head I'll say it will probably go lower but you could dollar cost average and see how that plays out so yeah that's just a quick video guys I wanted to give you this update I hope that answers your question I know I'm saying it can go up or down but I'm giving you different options of what you can do I'm giving you actionable steps you could buy a little here then buy a bit more if it drops and then see if it moves up if it breaks above these levels then yes I, I would be quite bullish if it breaks above the 200 uh, moving average because it's really important that it stays above the 200 moving average um, and the level that I am looking at heavily is this kind of 45 cents level that is a key level and there's a lot of confluence there as well so I hope you guys enjoyed that video if you have enjoyed it guys make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to my channel I do videos on daily technical analysis price predictions and I do a lot of XRP videos because I've got a lot of XRP subscribers and I also do daily technical analysis and price prediction videos so make sure you subscribe to my channel also if you want to win $250 worth of XRP make sure you subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button and leave your XRP address below to win $250 worth of XRP again if you haven't watched this video guys make sure you watch this video because you will definitely learn a lot again thank you very much for watching this video guys leave your comments below saying what you think about XRP where it will go in 20 years or price prediction for end of the year is it 589 that that you think XRP will go to just leave your comments and put reasons behind as well and also your XRP address if you want to be in with a chance of winning that $250 so thank you very much for watching this video guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much